Hi there, Cancer. Thank you for joining me for your monthly forecast for February. Now, not every Cancerian is a great lover of confrontation. You realise that if you work collectively with people, listen, hear what people say, often you can work your influence into the situation in more subtle ways. But you could find yourself in the first week of this month being much more to the point. Now, this could see you letting somebody know that you really fancy them. But it's also possible that you could be feistier in a different situation where in the past perhaps you would let things go. And the reason that you could be more direct is because the Sun is combining with Mercury in a very passionate part of your horoscope, but one which can see you determined to bring about changes which you feel need to be made. Now ironically there's a very dreamy, drifty, ethereal change on the 4th when Neptune moves into a great part of your scope for travel, for loving film and art and all sorts of exploring in terms of your imagination. But that's going to be an influence that is going to be around a long time, many years. But certainly more directly this month I do feel there's going to be a much more direct approach to the way that you deal with things. You're going to uh, have a more instinctive reaction to things. Now if someone has been playing a few games with you, perhaps they're going to be surprised by how much you get on the front foot. But then once Venus moves, and it moves on the 8th, the suggestion here is that you can still use a light touch where necessary, particularly in a working situation. But as Venus moves forward, so it does square up with Pluto. And sometimes, even if you are trying to do things in a pleasant way, someone could still take it the wrong way. Fortunately, as this month goes on, both Mercury and the Sun move into much freer, much more abandoned positions, if you like, where you're going to want to escape some of these intense pressures and politics. And if you can get away and have a holiday or a break or travel, it certainly will be very therapeutic for you. A new interest or hobby can also do the same. It's been a pleasure being with you. Thank you for joining me. Good luck and goodbye for now.